being a master inventor for me means but supporting others, especially young researchers in our lab in the patent development process. Usually there are lots of good ideas around, but the step from writing up a disclosure that is sound uh, is not straightforward. And I see my task in helping those people to achieve this. I think there is a secret recipe, and that is a lot of curiosity and a little bit of ignorance, maybe. So the curiosity drives you to explore new fields, to discover new areas, and this helps you to find the dots. And then you have to connect these dots. And to connect these dots, that's where maybe you need a little bit of ignorance, or to put it in another way, um, you need to be able to detach from the common knowledge. So my first part was uh, about the work we were doing in IBM Flash System back in the day, working in the Flash System controller, and trying to improve the performance and reducing the overhead of the cleanup process or garbage collection. Um, this garbage collection is basically the process that your mobile phone goes through after you're overwritten or deleted and wrote a new many pictures. And you might notice a slowdown and that's typically due to the system trying to clean up uh, the space to make up for new space for you to write to. Um, so we had an idea that the process could be dramatically improved by uh, identifying hot pieces of data that sh you should uh, let age more before trying to clean them up. And um, uh, a senior researcher, part of the team at the time, suggested that it was a patentable idea. He walked me through the process and the uh, drafting and reviewing of the, of the patent submission and it got granted actually in 2017. And I, I never thought that a problem that you solve uh, for your day-to-day -day work could lead up to a, a patent.